I started drinking when I was 15. Right away, I noticed that I could drink much more than my friends. I had two blackouts that I was told about. On my second blackout, a friend told me that I ended up in a ditch. I got myself out and somehow got home. I didn't remember anything. The blackouts really scared me. My biological father is an alcoholic and I don't want to end up like that. Then I had my own son and I realized I don't want to be drunk around him. Bible lessons paved the way as you travel down life's road. You'll find a peace and happiness in a place called home. There are lots of ways to get to the land of health and wellness. Eat healthy foods, get exercise. Don't do drugs, get plenty of sleep. And don't drink alcohol when you're underage. You know, alcohol is a poison. The liver tries to get rid of the poison, that's why you get so buzzed up. Yeah, I know, alcohol is legal, but not for kids. <laughs> It's all about making a commitment, really. Making a commitment to enforce laws that are already written. I mean, somebody wrote those laws for a reason, right? So, doesn't that mean they're supposed to be enforced? We don't really get to just pick and choose. Kids aren't supposed to be able to buy liquor at stores. And if the law says we can't drink till we're 21, then if adults buy us liquor, we're never going to get to health and wellness. And all we're really learning is how to break laws, isn't it? It's all about making and sticking to a commitment. Like those forms, we have to sign to be able to do sports or after school activities. Push her away and be like, no, you're not gonna talk to her. Those forms really do say we are committing ourselves not to smoke, drink, or use drugs. When we sign the form, aren't we making a commitment? Aren't we giving up a word? If we sign the form, then we go off and drink or do drugs, all we're learning is that our word and signature don't mean anything. When the battle rages between my heart and my mind, I've lost my balance. And I've crossed the line I look for strength But it's so hard to find Yup, the journey to health and wellness is on the road to making a commitment and finding people along the way who will help guide us. We're committed to enforcing underage alcohol laws in Russ County. We are committed to enforcing our school's drug and alcohol policies. I am committed to not selling alcohol to underage kids. I am committed to not serving alcohol to underage kids. We are committed to being the best parents we can for our kids. We're committed to helping our friends stay alcohol free. I am committed to be the best father I can for my boy. 
almost here. There it is, just up ahead. The gateway to health and wellness. It's just a breath away.